What up, peeps? Welcome to today's vlog. We got Abby and Ryan. Yo, what up? Today is, is it Friday? Do my shirt. You, 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 you. Is it Friday? Uh, yeah, it's Friday. Oh, that's, that's so it's Friday. And we've been pretty busy so far. Um, right. I think only one trade-in though, right? It's just the one. It's a big trade-in, but I think yeah. it was just one. Are you gonna um, buy those figures? We have sold two more of the Retron bundles today, which is really, really cool. <laughs> they will be going up on the website. I just don't know when, maybe today, who knows. We also got our bubble mailers delivered, which we've been needing. But we have a gigantic PSP trade-in to show you guys. There are a few things that I have taken out that we're going to be keeping. You'll see that in the next pickup video. But, you guys will see my pickups. Yeah, Ryan's got some pickups to show as well. <laughs> but let's look at this bundle. So minus a couple things that we are keeping, here is the bundle, guys. So we have a PSP complete in its original box. We actually have two of these. There's one more in the back we have not put out yet. So we're going to have two of this exact bundle. One loose game, Crazy Taxi. And this was from a different trade-in that just came in, uh, Japanese Bomberman. They bought this from us, but they brought it back and traded it towards a 360 controller and a 360 game. And then we have all these. This entire stack is factory sealed. These two are open. Only two games did not have manuals. Everything else was complete. So we're going to look at the sealed ones first. We have Siphon Filter, Dark Mirror, Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker, Secret Agent Clank, Loco Roco 2, Final Fantasy Tactics, War of the Lions. And we have a bunch of movies here, which I guess I'll just go through them like this. Well, there's some cool ones. Nothing really expensive. The majority of these we priced at five bucks. Uh, one of them I think was $8 and one of them was $3. And then for the PSP games, you have the Genesis Collection, God of War, Ape Escape, Worms, Grand Theft Auto, Daxter, Midway, Metal Gear, and then Star Wars Battlefront, Capcom Classics, Crash of the Titans, a Complete Crazy Taxi, Alien Syndrome, Pursuit Force, Crisis Core Final Fantasy, Afterburner. There's some pretty good ones in here. There was one more item that was not PSP that is a condition upgrade for our personal one. So I'm going to show you guys that, but uh, just understand that the one we're actually selling is going to be in a little bit worse condition. And that is a complete copy of Castlevania III Dracula's Curse. So, like I said, we already have this game at home, but ours has a little bit of creasing on the side and stuff. This one is really, really nice. So, this is an awesome condition upgrade, and we'll be bringing the other one back probably tomorrow, and that one will be going out on the shelf. What'd you get, Ryan? All right, so I got some PSP stuff. Well, you haven't paid for them yet. I haven't paid for them yet, but I'm going to get them, most likely. I don't know about the Castlevania one. I'm probably going to get it, but just in case. I don't think I showed that one. Nope, I have it right here. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, got Aeon Flux or whatever. Sealed. Sealed. Got Beavis and Butthead Volume 1 and 2, I believe. Sealed. Sealed. And then... Castlevania. Oh, yeah. The Dracula X Chronicles. It's pretty sweet. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. Complete. All right, guys. So we have a few packages here, which have all of the new candies in them. Sweet. We're turning this little end cap here into a little candy thing, and we're going to advertise it on our social media as, like, uh stocking stuffer type stuff so the shelves are not here yet but we can put some of them out now we have simpsons duff mints oh. we have rick and morty <laughs> strawberry smiggles oh. we have the mario mushroom candies oh yeah we have the bullet bills you know it we have star candies we have the coin block ones. We have Pac-Man ghosts. <gasps> Ghost sours. Ghost. We have Ninja Turtle watermelon shell sours. They're oh, all sour. We have Hello Kitty sweethearts. <laughs> we have the orange sword sours. I think it just looks like Link, actually. It's a little metal tin. And we have... Dragon Ball Star Candy. Nice. So that's the first box. That's cool. 
And then in this one, we have a few more. This is so cool. We have the Pac-Man little mini arcades oh, yeah. with the candy in them. Those are super cool. We have Cuphead sour orange flavored candies. Nice. That's we cool. have Mega Man <gasps> E-Tank shaped peppermints. E-Tank. That one's really cool. That is cool. We have the Mario Kart mystery item box. These just have yeah, different those... little uh, mystery tins with candy. We've had that before. We have the Super Nintendo controller candy. We have one left out there. This is a new one for us. NES controller, Nintendo Power Mints. And then lastly, this one's a little different from the rest. We have Halloween 2 Slasher Sour oh, Candy. What? <laughs> oh yeah. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> hey Ryan, what's in those bags over there? My stuff. <laughs> What'd you get? They already know. Let's see them. They already know. No, they, saw they, they only saw the games. They know about the, the toys. Ryan got the Simpsons stuff. I did. Well, I said at the end of yesterday's vlog, Ryan didn't get these. Oh. So I put them out. Oh, okay. <laughs> but well, he, he came back for them. <laughs> sorry, guys. I had to come back just for the, the toys. I didn't gonna get to that at all. I'm thinking about gonna it. Get that I'm looking one. to see if I have it already. <laughs> I need to scroll, scroll through my hundreds of games. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, hold on. When are we going to get a Ryan room tour? Uh, someday. Eventually. <laughs> yeah. In the future. So. What if you came over and we we did a Cooper and Ryan pickup video? <gasps> what? Instead of just a Cooper pickup video. Hmm. I could do that. I could probably do that. That would be cool. I'd have to start putting my stuff yeah. off to the yeah, side. Start. Well, you can't do that all the time. What's up? Nothing. Abby wants to be in a pickup video. Oh. No, I'm I'm annoyed because I like any time like. Already got it, guys. Any. <laughs> what? I already got this. <laughs> <laughs> like anytime you're doing a pickup video, stop zooming on my face. I'm not. I'm zooming. not happy. <laughs> I'm not zooming. <laughs> anytime you do a pickup video, you like, like hassle me out of the room and everything and you're like this is nothing to do with the vlogs this is serious you can't be in it that's you that I've is only done you. that maybe once no anytime it's embarrassing when i'm doing a pickup video and then you just like pop your head in and start staring at me when i'm looking at the camera <laughs> and i have to try to ignore you <laughs> or else it gets weird <laughs> you funny. can be in the pickup videos if you want to show your stuff no. Most of it gets shown in the vlog, but... I don't want to show anybody my stuff. Fine. Fine. Don't do it then. I won't. All right, guys. These are the last three trade-ins of the day. I'm going to show you guys these. We have one more thing to look at, and then we're going to be heading home. So we have a factory-sealed Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival. Um, this one is going to go in the closet. That's why there's no price tag on it. It's only worth like 10 bucks anyway. We have Dissidia Final Fantasy disc only. Digimon Cyber or Story Cyber Sleuth disc only, and then Dragon Ball Z Battle of Z for PS3. Rhyming like a madman over here. We have Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition for PS4, and also the Planescape Torment Icewind Dale Double Pack. Kingdom Hearts, uh, the story so far. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory, and then we have Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2 and Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 1. And then finally, we have Final Fantasy X, X2 HD Remaster. Pretty sure this is technically only the first game. Is that right, Abby? What? Yeah. Yeah, because the second one is a digital download. She bought that from us, too. Okay. So this was purchased from us and then traded back in. Um, we always disclose that it's only the first game. And then we have Mario Odyssey. That's the first time we've had this in in like a month and a half. And Luigi's Mansion 3. We have Super Street Fighter 4 for PS3. Dynasty Warriors 6. Final Fantasy 13, Street Fighter Alpha Anthology for PS2, and then the Strategy Guide for Final Fantasy 13. So, those are the rest of the trades from today. And then check this out, guys. We got these candies in today, as you saw. I got them into the system, and we got, we got them pretty much put up. 
The shelves that are here are the shelves that were already here. I have ordered different shelves to put them on that uh, instead of having them like this, the shelves slant this way and then they have a lip on the front to keep them from falling. So this will be changing a little bit, but for now we have them up here. I think it looks really, really awesome. Some of them are a little bit long, as you can see. This one's not going anywhere because it's wedged in with these, but for any of them that were longer than that even, we have them over here. So got the those three down there, and then we have some up here, and I think it looks awesome. I'm glad to have this kind of restocked. These always sell really, really well for us, which is cool. And being Christmas time, people are going to be buying these for stocking stuffers. I'm planning on posting some pictures on our Facebook and Instagram, probably doing another promoted post for it. That's where you pay to have it, um, you know, shown to more people. And uh, probably going to do that, advertise them as stocking stuffers, and hopefully get a bunch of people coming and looking for them. And then the more we sell, the more we can afford to put money back into them and get some more. Bye store.